how did we end up on this one? And suppose there are other worlds. Then ours is just a little piece of something much greater. Introducing Hearthfire, the latest in Skyrim add-on content. With Hearthfire, you can finally place a permanent mark on the world of Skyrim by designing, building, and maintaining your own home. Your first step on the road to home ownership is to purchase a plot of land. After obtaining a deed, use the new drafting table and carpenter's workbench to turn raw materials into your dream house, room by room. Build simple rooms like kitchens and libraries. Attach a greenhouse, enchanter's tower, or alchemy lab to grow and craft your own items in-house. Use the interior workbench to furnish each room with a large variety of craftable objects. Showcase your treasures with simple display cases and impress your friends with elaborate trophies and even mounted mud crabs. Fill out your backyard with a garden, fish hatchery, and other useful additions. To save time, hire a steward to simply buy materials and equip your household with furnishings. Stewards can also provide several transportation options and even your own personal bard. With your home completed, move in your spouse and adopt a child with the new adoption system. Really? But with a family comes responsibility. Need something, Paul? You'll need to carefully raise your children, all while protecting your homestead from skeever infestations and those pesky neighborhood giants. Download Hearthfire on Xbox Live on September 4th. Hey YouTube, just a quick commentary on this trailer you just finished seeing. The new Skyrim DLC Hearthfire. Awesome, right? So, I like how you can build a house. You have, uh, after you build a house, you can make an alchemy station where you can grow everything. I, I, I'm guessing everything. I, I'm probably sure there's a lot of um, plants you wouldn't be able to grow, like Nern Root. Because if you talk to one orc, she says that she's the last person that knows how to grow an urn root. So I don't think you, uh, as a player, would be able to grow it. Unless, with that DLC, they add that she teaches you. Um, which, that would, that would be cool. Because, uh, you know, it helped getting some urn root. Um, and, um, of course, there would be certain chemical um, uh, items for alchemy you wouldn't be able to get. Uh, such as farmer ears, dwarf and oil, that stuff you wouldn't be able to grow, so uh, certain elements will not be there. Another thing I like is that you can have an enchantment tower, so you can enchant, uh, so you don't have to go to uh, another person's building or out in your houses, because some houses you can't get enchantment tables. You can make, uh, you get to choose uh, how many. Well, as from what I, uh, I'm just gonna go from what I see in this trailer because it doesn't really go into deep detail. But you can make yeah, armor stands are pretty cool, and you can make a lot of armor stands for your house, which that's awesome. I guess you can select where you want your stuff, uh, what where you want your chests, how many you want, basement, attic, tower, because you see that main floor, second floor, like this is all stuff that's awesome. You can purchase property, and this is all stuff that makes the game just that much more real that much more there and you can do more stuff now with a house uh, obviously you're gonna have to cut firewood make nails which you've seen in the trailer you see nails but I'm not sure what other uh, items they will add such as planks uh, stuff, stuff that you would need to build the house now, I'm not completely sure how it works uh, but of course, we'll be seeing more of that soon in uh, further releases of this DLC, which I'm going to try to update as much as I can on this DLC uh, with more videos coming soon. Now, all my Skyrim uh, item, uh, all my Skyrim videos are not monetized, so almost nothing. Actually, most of my videos aren't monetized, but um, that's just a side note. So you won't have to put up with pesky ads every time you click on one of my videos. Um, but, uh, so yeah, this DLC is looking really good. It's adding more. You can adopt children. 
uh, so you can have kids now. Now I'm not, it says you have to raise them well. Now, uh, when you see a part of the video, and he's like, "Hey, I have something for you." I guess you can give your kids stuff. I'd give them weapons, man. I just give them full armor and weapons, and I make them go kill his sister or something like that. I don't know, but uh, <laughs> yeah, cause I'm just that great of a father. Um, so I guess that your kid can either rate you can raise your kid to be good, evil. I don't know. Maybe kids can die now because you have to protect them. Uh, so I guess there's a lot of factors added into the game. So that's another cool thing. So uh, that I think that'll end this commentary. It's all I can think of off of my head. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe uh, for more of my content. Uh, subscribe, of course. Hit the email me button if you want to be emailed. Every time I upload, follow me on Twitter because it updates every time I upload a video or add it to a playlist. Uh, like my Facebook, I try to work, uh, update there as much as I can too. Anyways, thank you for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and peace out.